Meet Chef Jimmy. He works in one of the best restaurants in the city and is a very good chef. But there are times when Chef Jimmy is a bit lax when it comes to his work. Today is Chef Jimmy's rest day, but he got awakened by a frantic call from his restaurant manager. Apparently, the restaurant overbooked and he needs extra help in the kitchen. Chef Jimmy tried to reason that his tummy is acting up a bit, but the restaurant manager pleaded that he needs to go to work. Chef Jimmy hurriedly put on his clothes and does not take a shower. He sees that his car's fuel tank is nearly empty, so he decides to commute. Taking a bit too long to hail a cab, so he rides an ordinary bus instead. Upon entering the restaurant, the restaurant manager orders him to work immediately. Instead of washing his hands, he gets the raw vegetables and slices them immediately. Things soon turn chaotic in the kitchen. People are getting hungry and the garbage is piling up. He goes outside for a quick trip to the dumpster, but before going back in the kitchen, he decided to grab a pack of cigarettes for a quick smoke. This time, Chef Jimmy was able to wash his hands, but instead of drying them properly, he wipes his hands on his dirty apron. Then he goes back to work. Now, if you knew that the chef responsible in preparing the meal for you and your family was not careful in handling the ingredients and utensils used in your food, would you still eat it? When a person ingests food that is handled unsafely, he is susceptible to different foodborne diseases. These diseases are infections of the gastrointestinal tract. There are as many as 250 known foodborne diseases. These happen when one consumes food or beverages contaminated with harmful bacteria, viruses, parasites, and chemicals. Types of which are botulism, Campylobacteriosis, E. coli, Hepatitis A, Novovirus infection, Salmonellosis, Shigellosis. According to the World Health Organization, about 1.8 million people die annually due to diarrheal diseases, which are attributed to contaminated food and water. That is why it is critical to ensure proper food handling to prevent any contamination. There are three sources of food contamination. Physical contamination, when physical objects such as hair, fingernails, pieces of plastic or paper, and machine equipment find its way into our food water. Chemical contamination, when chemicals are improperly stored and accidentally or unintentionally mixes with water or food. And biological contamination, when microscopic organisms which are often naturally present in food, grows and multiplies and are not properly eradicated. The five categories of biological contamination are Bacteria Parasites Viruses Protozoan Fungus and yeast It is very easy to curb the effects of these biological contaminants by remembering the things the bacteria needs to live and produce. Always remember, fat, tom, F for food, A for acidity, T for temperature. Another T for time, O for oxygen, and M for moisture. By removing or controlling the factors mentioned, foodborne illnesses can greatly be reduced. In 2013, President Benigno Aquino signed the Republic Act No. 10611, or the Food Safety Act, into law. The Food Safety Act of 2013 aims to promote consumer health by strengthening the food safety regulation system by monitoring and preventing unsanitary, unwholesome, misbranded, and adulterated foods from reaching the public. Objectives to strengthen the food regulatory system of the country are protect the public from foodborne and waterborne illness and unsanitary, unwholesome, misbranded, or adulterated foods. Enhance industry and consumer confidence in the food regulatory system. And 
achieve economic growth and development by promoting fair trade practices and sound regulatory foundation for domestic and international trade. The Department of Health lists five keys to safer food. Keep clean. It cannot be emphasized enough that washing hands when handling food is a must. Use gloves. Wash hands before putting on gloves and in between changing them. Regularly clean and sanitize the area where food is being prepared and the utensils that are to be used. Keep the food in area free from insects, pests, and other animals. Separate raw from cooked food. Raw meats, poultry, and seafood should be kept away from other food. Bacteria which may be present can be transferred from cooked food or other areas if these are not handled properly. Also use different sets of utensils when preparing raw foods such as chopping boards and knives. Store food in clean containers to separate them properly. Cook food thoroughly. Make sure that meat, poultry, and seafood are cooked well. Soups and stews should reach boiling point to 70 degrees Celsius. Food that are between 5 degrees Celsius to 60 degrees Celsius are in the danger zone. Food in this zone produces bacteria rapidly. It is ideal to use a food thermometer to check the internal temperature of the food. For meat and poultry, make sure that the juices are clear and not pink or reddish. Reheat cooked food thoroughly to 74 degrees Celsius. Keep food at safe temperatures. Do not leave food at room temperature for more than 2 hours. Refrigerate cooked and perishable food immediately, below 5 degrees Celsius. Keep cooked food hot, about 60 degrees Celsius prior to serving. Also, meat such as lamb, beef, and pork has a 3-minute resting time prior to serving. In those 3 minutes, the internal food temperature remains constant and kills any bacteria that may have been left behind. Do not store food in the refrigerator for a long period. Do not thaw food in room temperature. Thaw them in running water or in the refrigerator. Use safe water and raw materials. Use only clean and safe water. Select fresh food and wholesome food. Avoid canned food if possible. Choose food that has been processed for safety. Do not consume food past its expiry date. Following these rules can greatly reduce the chances of food contamination. People who handle food have a responsibility to the public to keep them safe through the produce that they serve. By taking care of themselves and keeping their surroundings clean and sanitized at all times, food safety is ensured. more about food safety, visit www.foodshop.com.